Uh, give yourself plenty of time. Go be able to go slow. Don't when when you feel rushed. That's when that's when real bad things can happen. Give yourself alternative routes as well. Um, we know that pretty much all the schools are, across the state are going to be closed today. So when it comes uh, to driving out there, be, please be aware that there are children out there. Uh, they're going to be trying to do their best probably to enjoy the snow, but uh, we have to be responsible uh, as, we're, as we're driving around, making sure that we're being uh, wary of our surroundings. Um, and, and check in on, on, on whether it's loved ones or, or maybe some of the, of the elderly that might be in your neighborhood, people that need might need a little extra assistance. If you have the time and, and availability, please do some of those those home checks for folks. You just giving a call can make all the difference, making sure that people have what they need. Uh, and if you do have an emergency, uh, just be sure to call um, y- either your local fire chief, local police chief. Um, you know, the state has a great infrastructure in terms of communications. We can get emergency resources uh, where we need that, where we need them to be uh, in very short order. Uh, we just need folks to be able to pick up the phone uh, and let us know. And, and again, when you're out there, we're going to have a lot of plows. DOT does a great job in the state keeping the roads plowed, uh, but they're going to be out there. And, and <clears throat> we've seen them out there. They kind of line up across across the highway sometimes. Be careful when you're going around them. Give them again, go slow. Give yourself that extra space. Uh, they're trying to do a job to make sure everyone else uh, can get safely from point A to point B. Um, our emergency operations center will open this morning at 8 a.m. for surrounding for the towns and the communities. Uh, who do need some extra help, and that center is really the hub of our communications infrastructure uh, during these these heavy uh, 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 winter events. And finally, the power outages. We know there. Uh, hopefully, it won't be too bad uh, because this is going to be a, kind of a light and fluffy snow. But when you add the wind on top, we know there will be some power outages out there. So again, we've uh, prepped and been working with all the utility companies. Uh, they have their crews and teams standing by. But, again, if something should happen in, in your area, please uh, let the utility companies know, and, and they'll get out there uh, as fast as they can. You know, sometimes it can take uh, hours or, or even days. We know that, but uh, the crews are ready, standing by, and I think we're in good shape uh, to get through this one. And hopefully we, we come on the other side uh, safe and happy on Friday with a little bit of sun, ready to enjoy a, a cold but a beautiful weekend. All right, Governor Chris Sununu joining us live there on the phone. Thank you for the updates.